Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Destiny and welcome back to yet another amazing video. So in today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to get the information of any mobile number from any country of the world with just Python. And all you need to achieve this is just the mobile number you want to get information about and four lines of easy Python code. So without wasting any more time, let's just get started. <laughs> So the first thing you need is a code editor or an IDE. So in my case, I'll be using the PyCharm IDE. You could get whatever you want, the Visual Studio Code or Sublime Text, whatever you want to use. So when that is done, the next thing you need is just one Python package. And the name of the package is phone numbers. So what you want to do is open up your command prompt or open up your terminal on your code editor or IDE and just type pip install phone numbers phone numbers so i already have this installed on my pc it's to show requirements already satisfied but in your case maybe you don't have it then just go ahead and give it some seconds to fully install then you're ready to go so the next thing you want to do is come back to your ide or your code editor and let's create a new file over here so i'm creating a new file and let's name this phone numbers or let's say phone number informations and i'm opening this here okay in my case i'm using pycharm code editor so you get this default codes over here so let's just get rid of this then the next thing you want to do is import phone numbers and to import phone numbers is as easy as just typing out import phone numbers and just like that it's already imported so when the package is successfully installed the next thing you want to do is come over to your text editor and let's import the phone numbers package that we installed some few seconds ago and from the phone numbers package you want to import phone numbers again and import from phone numbers we want to import geocoder and we also want to import carrier which will give you the network provider and we also want to import time zone if you need the time zone of the country where the mobile number is located so when that's done the next thing we want to do is define a variable and let's call this number is equal to let's set the phone numbers package dot parse so with dot parse it should take in just one argument which is the phone number and in some cases you might want to put the phone number as i'm in nigeria and uh, if i want to do this like putting a, a normal default number that we usually use like 080 it wouldn't work so what you want to do is use your country code like this so i'll just put in a random number here let's use this so when this is done the next thing you want to do is write a code that would print the country's name and in order to do that let's type out print geocoder dot description for number like this then it should take in two arguments and the two arguments one is the phone number variable that we defined earlier phone number and the next one so let me just type the right and the next one should be n like this so the next code we want to write is a code that would print the service provider so in order to do that you could just type out print then carrier dot name for numbers just like that and it should also take the phone number variable that we created earlier phone underscore number and it should also take en just like that then the last one is to print the time zone you know you have to do that just easy just type out print time zone dot time zone for numbers just like that then it should take only the phone number variable just only that so with this you're pretty much done all you have to do is just come over here and run your code and let's see what you get and in some cases you might need an active internet connection so let me just connect to the internet now okay i'm connected to the internet and let's just run this and see what we get so when we run this you see we got nigeria the country is nigeria and i'm using a nine mobile the, the network provider is nine mobile and it's in africa lagos by the way i'm in abuja so i'm it's just given like like the capital of the country or something so 
Nigeria, Nine Mobile, Africa, Lagos. And you could just put in another number here. So let me just put in a number from the UK. And here I've gotten one number. Let me just get it real quick. So let's just put in. I got. So I got another number from the UK. Let's just put in this number here and let's see what we get. So as you can see, this is from London and Europe, London. But I don't know, it's not printing the network provider's name. Maybe this is just a dummy number. I don't know if that's actually right. But the one I inserted earlier was right so it gave me the network carrier and i think that should be it for this video hopefully you learned something new today in python so that was it for today's video hopefully you enjoyed the video and learned something new and if you did do not forget to drop a like and also consider subscribing to stay updated with future videos and i hope i'll see you in my next video bye